very nice environment. Hey, what's up everyone? This is Super Reploid CLE. How are you guys doing on YouTube? It's good to see you guys again after I did a few videos. I did the milestone video, I did a few gaming videos, and of course I did some other great stuff on my YouTube channel for you guys to see. And since I have tons of leisure time on my hands, I think it's time I go ahead and uh, get this vlog started for you guys since it's been a long time once again. It's also been almost been a week, I, I would say. Um, what should I talk about? For Oh yeah, um, game tap. Now, for many years ago, there was this commercial called, there was this commercial where they have these tons of these console games and arcade games, mostly arcade games because, well that's why I, that's all I saw on game tap and it costs like 99 cents or more for premium or gold version and um, so I saw a commercial one early morning where they have realistic type games and of course some arcade games as well and I went to the website, right, GameTap.com, if I'm not mistaken, and I saw what it has, a lot of games that I know recently, some that I never tried, but I've seen them before, and of course, I've seen some new ones as well. So, I saw the first one I played, GameTap, well, let me get to, uh, okay, so, I went to the website, GameTap.com, right, and I saw these games. Some of them were free, and some of them required 99 cents for a gold version. And you had to be a member of GameTap to play free games. But a few years later, after I got a chance to know GameTap, I noticed that there is this button called Play for Free Online until it expires. So, the first game I played at GameTap was 1941 Counter-Attack, made by Capcom. It's one of those, uh, shoot -em -up games made by Capcom. But that wasn't the first time I played 1941 Counter-Attack before, because one time, at Nicarama, for those of you who know the place called Nicarama where every arcade game or ticket winning machines that you go to cost only a nickel or more. So I saw this hyperspin cabinet, right? And they had 1941 Counter-Attack in there. And of course, 1942 and 1943, the Battle of Midway. So I tried 1941 out and it took me there. And I played the game for the very first time. It was a very great game so far, but it looked like real war because of, because of the text that they had at the beginning parts when you start the first mission. So I got a chance to play it a little more on GameTap.com for free until it expired. So got some more gameplay experience with it. Now after GameTap for 1941, that's when I switched to Mummy 32, and I think later on I'll give you guys a little tutorial on how to get. Mummy 32, how to play arcade games on your PC, actual arcade games like Galaga, Pole Position, Miss Pac-Man, Pac-Man, Xevious, X Exus, and, and of course Elevator Action, etc, etc, etc. So if I get time, I'll make a tutorial video for you guys and go from there. So that way, you can leave your quarters at home, plain and simple. So the next game I played at GameTap.com was um, 1942. Now I never played the arcade version of it before, ever since when the time came. But I did play the NES version, and of course I had that on Mommy 32 as well. The next game I played was 1943. Now those two games, 1942 and 1943: The Battle of Midway, were both on 1980sgames.com/us, and. Speaking of which, I wonder if that website is still alive, even today. And of course, GameTap.com as well. The next game I played was Super Gym Fighters Mini Mix, where you got these chibi characters like Ryu from Street Fighters, Ken, Chun Li, Morgan, Marissa. I mean, uh, I mean Tessa. I'm sorry, Tessa, Zanjiev, uh, Sakura, and of course a few other ones as well, including Dan. Now there was another fighting game that I don't remember what the title of it was, but I know Morgan Anzone was in there. And of course Felicia. Ah, I forgot about Felicia on there. I always go with that character during my time with Super Gym Fighters Mini Mix because I wanted to see her ending, but I never got a chance to because Morgan kept beating me. If 
<laughs> I didn't. I can't believe I didn't forget about that time. So yeah, I would say that Game Tap is both free and premium at the same time. Well, in, when it comes to free, it lasts for a limited time because when it comes to premium, I mean the gold version, that's when you go free. I think I don't know the terms fully about the gold version of Game Tap and um, premium. I do know when it comes to getting those. Like you get when it comes to being a member of Game Tap. Whether it's gold, premium, etc., 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 you get like more than the limited of days on the free version, and that's how Game Tap is. So years later, after that, that's when I became familiar with an arcade emulator called Mommy 32 Local Arcade Machine Emulator. All right, guys, that's it for this vlog. I hope you guys enjoy watching to the fullest. Be sure to check out my other vlogs, reviews, and responses, and other contents I have on my YouTube channel. Also, keep playing arcade games when you're, when you're at home or at the arcade centers. <laughs> I run it at home because I got tons of arcade games on my laptop. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it for this vlog. More videos to come soon. This is Silver Reploid CLE. Like, comment, subscribe, favorite. Don't forget to share because we care. Join my community. The link's in the description. Follow me on Google+. See you guys on the next video.